America, the good old USA, has a very big problem at the moment. Well, they have two, actually. They go by the names of Joe Biden and Kamala Harris. When you look at the news, unless it's got a certain uh, left-leaning uh, persuasion, you'll see that their approval ratings are through the floor. Nobody likes them. And the chances of them winning any kind of second term, if there was an election tomorrow, are growing more slimmer by the day. It's very obvious that Joe Biden is in over his head with countless bits of footage regarding his apparent mental state. And there's one particular channel which does this very, very well indeed. I'll tell you who they are next. <laughs> How do everyone welcome back to the channel for a Monday hope you're doing all right listen can you do me a favor if you haven't subscribed to the channel already and you're new here or you you're a regular watcher and you haven't can you please hit the button underneath mark subscribe hit the notification bell as well and uh, that way you're on the channel and you'll be notified every time I put something else up also give the video a like as well you know what Joe Biden the more and more and more footage I watch, the more and more I become concerned. You know, we had this whole get rid of Trump routine. You know, Trump's an outsider. He's racist, he's racist, he's all the other things. And you want to get rid of him. Well, we've ended up with Joe Biden. And we do get concerned by the day about his mental state his inability to string a sentence together, his inability to cope without some kind of teleprompter in his ear, his inability to not break wind in front of royalty, and the list goes on and on and on. Have a look at this. That's Alan Jones of Sky News Australia, and they have it absolutely banged to rights. If you do a search on YouTube of that video title, you will find a video which is a big catalogue of blunder after blunder after blunder made by Joe Biden, either forgetting his sentences, not knowing what to say, or fluffing it up totally, or farting in front of Camilla Parker Bowles. Either way, I wonder how a man like this can remain the head of the biggest country in the world. They call him the leader of the free world. I don't see it like that. I see it. He's the president of the United States and they're in a whole world of trouble. I can't see how this facade could continue for any longer. I genuinely don't think that he will last till 2024. I think there will be some kind of medical uh, dilemma which means he would have to stand down and someone will have to go in his place be that Kamala Harris or anybody else but hell what do I know it just concerns me the more I read about this I wonder if something accidental may happen someday and he will be the one solely responsible let me know what you think particularly if you're in America I've put this video out at a time of day where I hope some, uh, some more Americans see it. Definitely interested in your point of view. Are you a Trump fan? Do you want him back in 2024? I know a lot of you are. Or if you're not, who do you want in his place? But this Joe Biden fiasco, is, it's got to end, if not for his own health and welfare, for everybody else's. This is a Gabby Cabby for now, signing off. Toodaloo. Toodaloo.